guys welcome and welcome back to the channel it's a girl sorry here again today guys i'm back with another video for you guys so today is part two of the series that we started on my previous video if you didn't watch that video please go check it out you are going to fall in love guys because most of the things that we're going to be talking about today is just a continuity of what we already started so please go check it out the video will be popping up somewhere somewhere here so go check it out guys so if it's your first time watching my video welcome to the channel please don't forget to subscribe like and comment and if you are returning to my channel welcome back and thank you so much for your support and please don't forget to follow me on instagram i'll be very very honored to welcome in my family without wasting your time let's go to the video so in today's video like you can see guys i'm not alone again i'm with my sister nana here like i said go check the video that we posted it's crazy guys it's so crazy so in today's video guys we're going to be talking about dating in the congo most dating here in south africa guys. my sister nana how are you i'm fine about you i'm good i'm good so, so let's go to the video guys here nana tell us dating in congo what do you see is different that people are doing here in South Africa than what was happening in the city. According to me. Yeah. Of course. <laughs> yeah. According to me, if I can say something is like in ladies here, they are beautiful. Mm -hmm. Ladies, I know that you are watching me. Mm -hmm. I know that you are commenting and you are gonna like also. Mm -hmm. You the one who are commenting and telling you that you are beautiful. You know that. But ladies I never know that I don't know they are value. Mm -hmm. They don't know that they are beautiful. Mm -hmm. Even in my country there is a beautiful ladies. Man. Definitely. Yeah, I come from there. My, my dear friends, my dear sisters, we come from there, you know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> we are also beautiful. But I'm saying here, guys, you are beautiful. Right. When we are looking at you, I say, wow, this one, you take you did take time. Mm -hmm. But you, you see, well, the the things that I noticed where I was working. Okay. Where I used to uh, to say mm -hmm. that ladies here that don't insult. Sorry, I'm not insulting, but I'm saying that according to ladies that that I sit, I spend time with them, mm -hmm. they are cheap. Okay, what happened? You can see a beautiful lady mm -hmm. is dating a man all because of lunch. You see, after dating, <laughs> after going out. Maybe before they go out, when we are at work, I'm telling you, I'm, so, I'm talking about experience at work. Mm -hmm. oh, I'm waiting for my boyfriend to come. Mm -hmm. Nana, my boyfriend, I can say, yeah, today, yo, we are going to enjoy. Your boyfriend is coming. Mm -hmm. You know, like me back home, I know when like, we are waiting for my boyfriend. Mm -hmm. I know that mm -hmm, my friend, I know that yo, today you're going to be full to Nana. Mm -hmm. Nana going to feed us mm -hmm. to, to his boyfriend money. You see, it's yeah. what we know, what we put our man. Not only two rand, five rand. No, you guys, you're going to eat and you're going to drink True. with my, bon my boyfriend money. Mm -hmm. So that mind, I bring it here. Mm -hmm. When my colleague was saying that I'm waiting for my boyfriend to come, I say, yo, today is my happiest day, yo. Yeah. I'm going to enjoy the lunch. I say, let us wait. And when the boyfriend come, that took time, that took time. In the end of the day, lunch, 30 rand. I say, huh? And that 30 rand, they, call, they will come 10 rand and some coins. Coins. I say, yeah. <laughs> my friend. Why are you making yourself cheap? You see, these things happen many times. Yeah. I, others, I can see, I say, I also have friends, uh, um, not boyfriend, the friend. I, I like to stay, to spend time with boy, a guy. You see, when we are talking, mm -hmm. men also used to tell me all that. I say, no, no, you know what? I have a car. This front seat is for my co-pain. I say, Mr. Melissa, what is my co-pain? I say, what? What is the Makwapen? I've been thinking maybe Makwapen is food. Yeah. Hey, Makwapen is something like this. No, no, this one is for Makwapen. I say, ah, this chair is called Makwapen. I say, no, it's for Makwapen to sit here. Makwapen, Makwapen is, 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 is what? Explain. It's girl, girl, is, you see? Who likes the car? <laughs> <laughs> I say, you see this car, this place is all for Makwapen. Is when you're gonna sit here, Nana, I all bought here to McDonald's. Mm. I buy something for her. The same day, I will finish everything, and the following day, I change the number. I say serious, and these things was happening, ladies. I'm telling you, it was happening, and not only with ugly ladies, beautiful, very beautiful ladies, guys. So we're not saying these things doesn't happen in Congo. You know, we're not saying that it doesn't happen. It does, but it's not something that is on your face. You know, Serious. it's not something that is on a face. It's it's a rare thing. In Jersey, Congo, 
dating guys you can see a woman can have a crush on a man but he's not gonna go and tell the man that i have a crush on you yeah you know i like you i want you to be my boyfriend that's why it, it's happened well, you know men when you approach the man you tell him that i have a crush on you yes they will feel good that a woman comes and approached me and they want to date me they ended up dating you some will some won't you're not gonna have that much of a value because he's not the one who approached you you know you approached them so there's a say that they usually say in congo date someone who loves you not the one that you, you love, love. You because suffer. the person that you love got someone that they love so when you love someone as a woman and you approach them i know the world is developing and mm -hmm. you know yes but don't take away the place of a man like let a man be a man mm -hmm. let a man start the conversation even if you have a crush on that person let that person start the conversation okay yeah. and here ladies are asking first of all if you know you're approaching him you will be kind True, yes, that's very true. The first thing, do we have a car? Mm. You know, in our church, one lady was dating a, a guy that is working there by the mine. Mm. And we know that the lady is rich. Mm -hmm. Or oh, the lady was only following that in uniform that the people are wearing. Mm. Mine. <laughs> just just the fact that she that was the the mine. uniform <laughs> and the car for the mining, the lady was following. Mm. After some months, the, the lady fall, was pregnant. Mm -hmm. And they came to us, Yo, I don't know what I'm going to do. I'm pregnant. Don't know what you want to do. No, you have to do something. This man. Us, like we are thinking that maybe the man told him what you want me to do. You yeah. see? <laughs> because the way you saw the man, I say, ah, this one is his head. He works at the mines. As you come to our proposition, you know what? He mm -hmm. must propose you. He must marry you. Just take your things, your stuff. You are pregnant. You're ready to go stay together. No, the man denied the pregnancy. I say, ah! Okay, okay, denying is not a, a, a problem. Okay, problem. we're gonna see these things later. Not even one of them. So, when sister's been dating, the guy never gave her. Nothing. And you ask her, not even one run. You guys, so what are, why follow her? What do you are following for, to this guy? Yeah? Mm -hmm. you, uh, what Mina was saying, only because he was giving you 2,000 rand. 3,000 rand. 5,000. Because I can't say uh, 50 rand or 100 rand because it's got uh, some mining. You mm -hmm. see mining. Yeah. So I would say 3,000 rand, 4,000 rand, 1,000. If it's more, 1,000. Mm -hmm. Only because of 1,000. You get pregnant. You say, yo, nana. Not only 1,000, you are going so far. <laughs> I say, too far. So how much was given? You say, if it's too much, 300. I say, yeah! <laughs> so, I didn't laugh a lot. That laughing was not the It was laugh. a sad one. Like, you to, say, uh, yeah. it's sad. Yeah, so sad, sad, 300. And then look at the lady. She was always looking nice. And I was talking to myself, that's looking nice. It's all you. Yourself. Because this 300 rand, because they're not asking you know. We think I was saying that they all the what clothes that you're wearing by yourself. And you go there, you give everything like you are married. Mm. Nice. And you can see all other of my uh, my colleagues sometimes gonna go to the men's uh, to the boyfriend <gasps> uh, spending weeks. Mm. So I don't want to lose my, my man. Because if I don't go there, you're gonna get another woman. I say, my friend, you never give you anything. I never get you gonna marry you because you are already living a married life. Mm -hmm. Because you can, you see, in life, if I can say something, my sister says, ah. you see, all the women mm -hmm. are not wife. True, true. All the women are not wife. Men outside there, they are not looking for a woman. They are looking for a wife. Mm -hmm. Once he went out. He have in mind that I need a, a, a lady to spend time. In the, in the first conversation, he's talking with a woman. Mm -hmm. So when you're going to spend time with him, mm -hmm. with a man, he needed to see a wife in that lady. Mm -hmm. So that way you can see a man was serious. But a lady make him to not be serious because of your behavior. Mm -hmm. Once you, you say yes to a man today, yo, 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 you give all yourself, like you give to God, to Jesus, I surrender, oh, I surrender. <laughs> you surrender. For you, there is no no. You, since you, you say yes in the beginning, you remain by 
yes. Yeah. Young king Tom. <laughs> yes, South African used to say, young king Tom for you is yes. You think that you are making that man happy. Mm. Yeah, you are happy because he's satisfying himself. Mm. But the day that will help in that man that you want to get married, mm. you're going to leave him. Yeah. That's why you are saying, ladies, today, I spent time with that man. With, uh, I suffer with him. Now today he's marrying another woman. No, no, no. And I don't know. I'm not condemning men. Mm. When the men are talking to us, I say, why did you do that? Mm. Look, 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 I know tomorrow when I'm going to spend time with this lady, if when I'm going to travel, you're going to cheat. Yeah. You're going to do this. Yeah. You're gonna, it's not a man's fault. If you're a lady, you value yourself. A man going to value you. True. You understand? Mm. I like one word Rihanna used to say, I'm not my best fan. Be your first fan. I always say that also. Be your first fan. And you know, you remember when we were growing, our parents were telling us one thing. A man can buy you a car, mm. a man can buy you a house, he can give you anything. But us, we only have one thing that is special that we are giving to a man, you know. You mm. know the things that I'm talking about. <laughs> I don't want to say it here, but you know. Mm. You see, that thing, once you give it to him, he's going to get used to that. And tomorrow, he's going to think about going testing other things outside, you see. Once you go, you, you see men, they're, they're also getting their time to sit mm. and think. Yeah. When you're going to sit down, Think about a, a woman to get married to. Mm -hmm. You're gonna come back to you. True. That, yeah. That's very true. Guys. That was on South African side. What about Congo side? How is it dating in Congo? How are women behaving when it comes to dating in Congo? Dating in Congo in my country. Mm -hmm. I'm about 15 years here. Mm -hmm. When I was there, mm -hmm. you see. Yo, ladies in my country, girl, I'm telling you. <laughs> Once a guy is coming from overseas. You all for what what mm -hmm. coming back home. Mm -hmm. You don't need to spend. You don't need to bring money or what impress the woman. Just bring perfume. <laughs> <laughs> you know us when a guy is coming from overside, outside of the country. Overseas, yeah. Overseas, outside of the country. Okay. Once they come back home, a guy just look nice. Mm -hmm. On the smell of the perfume. Women will start following the guy. By following the, the guy. After three months, when the guy gonna laugh, you gonna just see yeah, that this one have, is she's pregnant. Mm -hmm. The other one pregnant. The other and the man was a married man. The overseas he left. He left the wife and kids. Mm -hmm. Here, well, you guys are gonna say yo. All the man that the man brought here, you finish all the man and getting pregnant. What they give you? All the Nothing. smell of the perfume. Only the smell of the perfume. <laughs> You see guys, the conversation that we are talking about today is also to help women out there mm -hmm. on how to value themselves. Guys, we are letting ourselves go for mahala, mm -hmm. like cheap. And men know that. They know that when a man, when they have a car, if they want a woman, they just have to have a car. Yeah. And a small money, they know that they're going to get any woman that they want mm -hmm. but if they know that that woman is tough that woman value themselves that woman like doesn't go easily mm. they don't approach just anybody mm -hmm. not anybody they, they don't just approach and anyone. you know so is my sister mm -hmm. and you know men they are just tempting us True. when a man is approaching a lady or a woman mm -hmm. he's just tempting to just to see mm -hmm. you see the first step of men is is listening to a woman mm -hmm. he's seeing your attention is seeing your behavior. Mm -hmm. The way you you a, a lady you gonna behave is the way that you're gonna push a man to behave to you. True. They are just tempting us. Yeah. And there's something you can see ladies here, it's not that a man is married man. He's a married man. I said to the lady, you know you knew that he's a married man. Yeah, yeah. And when he told he told me it was a mistake. Yes, Suka is not a mistake. <laughs> That's what men always do. When they meet you, they're not gonna tell you that I'm happy. I'm just dating you because for the sake of dating I'm happy. No, they're always gonna tell you something is wrong in there. Yeah, relationship. it'll never be a mistake. So that's a bit of that for today. So the whole thing, what you can get from this video is value yourself as a woman wherever you are. Sex is not as serious to keep a man. Not at all. Like not at all. So that was the little thing that we wanted to share with you guys today. We hope this video was helpful for someone out there. So, so yeah guys, thank you so much Sister Nana for coming. You're welcome. Thank you so much guys. I will see you on my next video with my sister Nana with another topic. If you have something that you want us to talk about again, leave it on the comment down below and we'll come again with another banger video for you. Thank you so much and 